everybody! Welcome back to Pokemon Sweet Version Let's Play. Let's see, I'm currently in Cookie Village between Flower Town because I was leveling up. Show you guys a couple more Poke Sweets that I got. Okay, Applin. Oh, um, this actually reminds me. There are Pokemon from all generations. Um, well, not all. This, like, it doesn't have any sixth gen Pokemon, I think. But as you can see right here, there's a few fifth gen. So that's very exciting. Uh, pixel work isn't as great when it gets down to here. But hey, you have some Pokemon in here that aren't even from this gen, which explains why their pixel work wouldn't be very good right now. Like, I'm not really complaining at all. Okay. I'm gonna go back up to Flower Town. Go with Chikoria. No. We're gonna go back up to Flower Town, heal really quick since I forgot to do that before I stopped playing. And then we're gonna go up towards the forest. Or rather, we're gonna try. Our rivals, Mark and uh, Kavia, are blocking the way. So that's gonna be some sort of interesting fight. Pick some berries real quick. Okay, now let's go. We're already stocked up on potions and stuff. Hello. Oh, hey there, Red. We were looking to battle in the gym here, but it's closed. If you beat the strongest battler in the gym, you'll win a badge. I got a little bit too uh, trigger happy on the X button. He was saying he's wondering why they were gone. Red, we're headed to the next town. Follow us if you like, see ya. I expected a little bit more than that, but all right. Flower forest ahead, don't go alone. I see a present. Paralyzed heal. Awesome. Anything else? Yes. Either. And oh, it's a Pokemon. <laughs> Little cream balls. Oh, you're so cute. I want you. I'm going to catch you. Little whipped cream on his head. He's so cute. I'm sorry, a lot of this game is probably just gonna be me saying, oh, it's so cute. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't knock him out, don't knock him out. Don't do it. Okay. Oh, only one left. Oh, I need to stock up on those. I thought I had more. Oops. All right. It does its best to look cute and doesn't like being ignored. It has a very cute singing voice. That sounds like the regular Pokedex entry. I'm gonna actually go buy some more sweet balls. <laughs> I'm an adult. I'm totally an adult. I just I just got out of work an hour ago. I'm a grown up. I sliced up pieces of chicken and made old bay mayonnaise. There's no pokeballs here. Seriously? Oh, I scrolled right over it. Oh goodness. Maybe it was a longer day at work than I thought it was. Still, those trainee hours. You get paid a little bit extra, that's nice. It's low rent. Alright. Let's see what Pokemans are in here. More cream puffs. And we're just gonna run away from that. 
Again, any level grindy that I do, I'm gonna do it off camera because I'm not too interesting to watch. Mm -mm. Are there only cream puffs here? What about, what about over here? I want it. I want it. It's a little dream sickle. Give me the dream sickle. too close. Okay. Oh, excuse my bones creaking and popping if you hear them. Oh, come on. When it bathes in sunlight, the orange patches on its cheeks secrete an orange aroma in the area around itself. That's very pleasant. No. I imagine having a bunch of those would kind of be like living in an, in an orange orchard. It'd be really, really nice. And then, okay, I'm assuming those are the only ones I'm gonna get out of this then. So goodbye! I know, it's probably the same Pokemon, but hey. It doesn't hurt to check. Okay, yeah, no, I'm not gonna check anymore. I, I did so much leveling up earlier. And it was just all Meowfins and Lucaritas. Like, I'm done with that. Thank you. Flower Forest. It's very creative naming. There's only so much you can do. I'm not trying to be mean. That sound that came out like a lot meaner than I meant it to. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. Oh no. I'm noticing a kind of trend. <laughs> People are asking us to do favors for them. Which I'm okay with. If I get an award, heck yeah. Cookie tot and cotton. Oh, oh, it's cotton candy. Oh, that is precious. Let's see, let's see if they're weak against apple. And let's see. I'm gonna do Leer. That'd be nice. Don't die. Ugh, I hate that noise. Okay, not very effective, and not very effective. Guess who's getting switched? Goodbye, Applin. And you're gonna do Leer again. Because, hey, it doesn't hurt. brief moment of extreme lag. <laughs> okay, so it seems like there's going to be a bunch of Pokemon battles coming up, so I should probably fill that in with talking. Um, I mentioned a little while ago um, something about work. I finally had my first day yesterday, and today was my second day, and I am working in the kitchen in a restaurant, a chain restaurant, but I'm not gonna say which because I like this job and I want to keep it and I need to pay the bills. Um, but let's see, yesterday I started at the pie station, basically just, not baking pies, I mean there are pies that are made fresh in the restaurant, 
but um, I was slicing them up to be served, and I was plating them, and decorating them, which isn't that fancy, really. It just like what, like each pie except one gets whipped cream on it, and then be only because that one already has whipped cream on it. And then there's one of them that like on top of getting whipped cream, it also gets like chocolate and nuts. But um, so I did that yesterday and also packed up the to-go pie boxes. And that was all fine and well, except that the girl who was training me was a good bit taller than me, and um, she stacked the to-go boxes very high up, and I, I could not, I could not reach that. <laughs> I started, I started a, uh, so far, I've been coming in in the morning, before the restaurant opens, of course, and helping getting everything together and, and doing a lot of prep stuff. And today, that's actually what I did. I actually trained in the kitchen. Well, I mean, I trained in the kitchen last time, too. But, I mean, I, I did prep work. Um, got to kind of shadow the grill cook. And I really liked it. I, I really like the people there. The people there are really, really nice. They really are. And, um, I don't know, they're really nice people. They've all been really, really understanding. Um, anytime I mess up, they're good, they're nice. There's only, like, two other, two to three other women in there. But the guys are not pigs. They're nice, and they're respectable, and they're funny. Oh my god, they're too funny. I'm, they have me just dying cracking up. And they're so nice. They, they they were fussing at me yesterday because I'd been there a good while considering it was my first day. And they kept asking me, oh, when are you gonna, you know, what did you eat? Or, you know, what did you have for lunch? Whatever. It's like, I haven't had lunch yet. You didn't take a break? No. Why not? Well, I've been working. Like, you still take a break. And I kept saying, well, I don't want to slack off. And finally, the general manager is walking through the kitchen. And he says, it's not slacking off. In this business, you take a break when you can. So apparently that's something I need to learn is when to stop working. Okay, we got spin a cake. It hangs from and builds its web out of taffy. It also spins vanilla cakes for any unwilling guests. What? Unwilling. I don't know, I guess. I guess it's just a really friendly spider. If you get caught in its web, it's gonna make you some cake to apologize for you getting caught there. That's very comforting. I would not mind spin a cakes being in my apartment. It's compared to the spider I found the other day. Let's see who he needs. Okay. He was a very small spider, and I did not kill him, but I did fling him very, very far away from me. He was crawling on my arm, and I do not like that. I do not know you that well, Mr. Spider. Please buy me a drink first. God. Okay, let's get through this maze. Cookie tot! I am weak against you. That's right. I'm gonna switch. Level 6 isn't too far from 10. That's not too bad, right? And then we're gonna... Don't die. Okay. He might not die. We shall see. Please don't die. I'm trying to figure out what Cookie Todd is really supposed to be. I mean, he's... The, the color is right on with the theme, but like... I don't know, I can't really... I guess cookie, you know, he's made out of a cookie. So maybe he's just a, a big sugar cookie. Okay, well I'm out of Pokeballs, so... I'm gonna get you for the experience. And I'll just... I'm not gonna go back into Flower Town for more sweet balls. I'm just gonna keep going on forward and then whenever I stop to level up or whatever. Really? That didn't kill you? 
whenever I stop to level up again, after I get into the next town, I'll stock up. But for now, I'm gonna deal with it. Oh, so close. Oh no, it's trainer. Rude? What is up with these people? Okay, we learned last time that this duo does not work together. So, let's see. I'm gonna switch out and put Meowthin down. Because I really don't want to take too long in this battle. Dino looks like it'd be made out of Laffy Taffy, really. Like, it's very, it's very bright and very pastel and very pretty. And it reminds me of, um, Strawberry Laffy Taffy. That's right. Get out of here, Cookie Tot. Go home. Everybody's leveling up. That's what I like to see. Alright. Get out of here, Catnet. Yeah. What? No! That was supposed to be it. Finally. That's what you get for being so rude, Doug. God. So rude. I gotta shuffle some Pokemons around. Do do do. And then scoot you down. Okay. Onward. Um, I really hope this is the same layout as Viridian Forest. Or else I have no idea where I'm going. And I still may have no idea where I'm really going. Nope, that's the wrong button. Oh, here we go. Yes. Okay. It's just gonna bring me back down, isn't it? Damn it. Okay. Um, I think there's a little, yeah. Gotta go through there and beat up that punk. And when I get to the next town, I think I might do this off camera, but when I get to the next down, I'm gonna, um, take Popsichu out of my box and put him in my party. Hand over your lunch money? Really? How old are you? Five? I don't think so, dude. Antonio. Meowthin and cream puff. Yeah, those are very intimidating. And I'm, I'm terrified. I'm shaking in my little boots. Oh no, he lowered our attack. Whatever will we do? That was very creepy. I don't think I have any awakenings or anything. You're getting switched out. And I guess I'm gonna leer since we've lowered our attacks. See? Ugh, 
This is such a slow battle. I'm gonna level my Pokemon up even more because this is this is taking forever. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, you guys. I honestly thought that uh, I leveled most of them up to at least level 10, and I really did think that that would be enough, but oh my god. It's taking forever. No! Stop it! Stop! Stop! You know what? No. Wake your ass up. I'm gonna switch in Macarita as well. I, know, I feel I feel kind of like a, a revenge whenever I play Licorita against someone else because battling it in the wild was so annoying with lower level Pokemon because it you know the only offensive attack it knows for a while is absorb. So you know if you're lower level Pokemon and you're trying to just hack away at it, you're you're not getting very much because no matter how much damage you do, it's just gonna attack you and then heal itself back up, and it's. So frustrating. So whenever I send out Licorita now, I kind of feel like this sense of... I don't know, I feel like I'm getting revenge? Maybe that's just me, but... I'm a, li I'm a little bit vengeful. Taking forever. Oh, great. Now Meowth wants to puff the cream puff. Awesome. So close, so close, oh, so close. Oh God, I don't want to fight you right now. I don't, I just want to get to the next town. Just leave me alone. No, you monsters. Forcing me into battle. How dare you. Do we have any strawberry types? I don't think so. Well, I mean, Candino. Candino is strawberry and vanilla, but he doesn't know any strawberry attacks. Um. Because I'm wondering if strawberry might actually work a little bit better on those. But maybe they are strawberry. I know is that the cherry attacks didn't work on them. And the apple attacks didn't work on them. No, they can't be strawberry then, because... One of those is... I don't know. This typing thing is so much more difficult than the regular games. <laughs> it's so much more frustrating, dear god. Just everybody, just go. So, when Poke Sweets like die, like granted they weren't eaten, because apparently you just completely like it's okay to eat your Poke Sweets, just don't completely eat them. So like when they die, 
do they like you know rot away like like candy does not like you know of course everything rots away we all decompose but I mean like does it rot away like like bad food or does it kind of like crumble away into little sugar bits what happens Nope, nope. Meowth and you're getting out. I do not want to listen to that. I'm on Brownie Sore. I guess. Come on. Okay. No. That's. Oh dear lord. Okay, that's a little bit better. Come on. Okay, I gotta ask you guys: Would you be okay with me uh, fast forwarding through battles that I can't skip like this, or do you want me to just completely edit them out? Obviously, I wouldn't edit out gym um, battles or like the Elite Four or anything. But when it comes to stuff like this, this is just, it's taking forever. And, you know, if I don't really have anything to say, it's not going to be too interesting. So, you know, let me know. Do you want to see the battle, but wouldn't mind it being fast forwarded? Or would you rather just have it cut out completely? Heard some people bake pokey sweets with berries. Well, that is interesting. Oh, our old man. Um, hello? Old man. Oh, goodness. Well, no, I can't just leave him. I have to check on him. Are you serious? Food coma. Food coma blocked in the road. Great. Pudding City, we made it. Ugh, kiss the ground. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> no, the houses aren't made of it. Very nice. Well, I'm gonna go find that Pokemon Center, heal up, and save. Oh, there's Mark. I'll talk to him later. I'm gonna go do leveling up and, uh, you know, party switching around, and, you know, I'll let you know how that goes. Uh, in the meantime, please let me know what you want to see. Again, about the whole, um, the whole battle thing. Like, honestly, I am planning on skipping through wild encounters where I don't catch the Pokemon. Because if I do catch it, I do want you to, you know, see it and see the little Pokedex entry afterwards. But, um, if I don't catch it and just have to go through it or whatever, I'm just going to delete that. Um, but for battles with trainers, you know, trainer battles, if you want me to leave it in, but just fast forward it, please let me know. Or if you would prefer it to be cut out completely because, you know, yeah, I'm playing, but it doesn't really make a difference for me playing wise. I mean, I would definitely prefer to fast forward through it, but, um, just let me know what you guys want to see. You guys have to watch it, you know, and I wouldn't want... The way I'm making these videos, I'm trying really, really hard to not make stuff that I wouldn't want to watch myself. So please, let me know what you want to see. It's Your input is really, really valuable to me, and I do care about what you say, and I do take it into consideration with everything. So um, please leave a like and comment below on, you know, what you think. Thank you so much for watching, and please subscribe for more of this. I do so well until I get to that part. Um... Again, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, part one is already in the playlist. I'm going to add this as well. P this is... Uh, actually, part two should be in it by the time you guys see this as well. Huh. Recording ahead. It's a little bit confusing. Um, so, thanks again. 
and I will see you guys next time. Bye!